Well, gentlemen, I'm Brittany Frederick with the Hollywood Critics Association. Thank you so much for taking the time. Of Thank course. You for us. <laughs> I want to start this with like the nerdiest question ever. Both of you obviously are new this season, but at the same time, like you have your own separate plot. So how much like research or catching up did you guys need to do? Because, you know, you're coming in, but you're also doing your own thing. Sure. Well, uh, after watching the first season several times, some for enjoyment and some for <laughs> study purposes, um, came in uh, as well. Like obviously with my character's backstory was able to ask some questions and um kind of look into what Josh's interests were. So, yeah. <laughs> yeah, definitely. I mean, of course, you know, you watch season one and um, you enjoy it, you study it. Um, it's nice to be able to join a well-oiled machine, especially one that has the bar set so high. Um, but ultimately, yeah, it is a bit of a, it's a different story or a different character. All you can do is meet the circumstances and the character where they're at, yeah. And Miles, I want to congratulate you because this is the first time you've done TV. What has it been like for you from an acting standpoint, just playing in this format and, and living with this character for a longer period? Yeah, um, it, it's been really beautiful and also this extreme challenge. Um, I come from a bit more of a theater background. I went to theater school right before I booked the show. And it's a show that demands a lot from you, both on in an emotional sort of depth way and from a very physically challenging standpoint. You know, it requires a lot of stamina, it requires a lot of understanding of your body in space. Um, in that way, it is sort of like the actor boy in me's dream to be able to have something that you can really sink your teeth into, a, a character that is going on this eight episode long journey um, and being able to like play and feed off of the ensemble. It's yeah, it's, it's like constant acting class. <laughs> and then that's the nerdiest answer. <laughs> If it's okay, I, I am the world's biggest nerd. I actually sat there and like make notes on everything and everyone's like, nobody cares. Like, it's, it's not important. <laughs> so I'm going to throw this out there to both of you and, and either one of you can take it. Don't give anything away, but is there anything in this season that you guys were like, this is particularly awesome and you want people to be looking out for it as we start watching? <laughs> the drama. <laughs> there's so many, there's so many moments that bring excitement and shock factor and I think fans are going to be wildly surprised at the twists and turns in this season I'm not going to point out anything specific because I will say a spoiler <laughs> Miles what about you did anything kind of pop in your brain that you were like oh this is really cool I can't believe they pay me to do this <laughs> Um, yeah, two things in particular, both of them are spoilers, but I'll say one is a bit more of like a physically shocking, exciting, thrilling twist that um, was sort of, uh, yeah, I, I guess the word is exciting to be able to play with. And then one of them is a, a twist that brings this very emotional, very complicated, very touchy dynamic to the boys island um, and sort of traversing through that uh, trickiness is I think a, a twist that um, audiences are going to really uh, well, gravitate towards. Guys, thank you so much for letting me spend a couple of minutes with you. It's been an absolute pleasure. Yeah, thank you.